Well, the building itself is is uh, revolutionary, if you like. I mean, you know, this net carbon and. You know, we've got hundreds of kilometres of pipes underground where we're using the energy from the ground to, to, um, for the power of the building. In order to install some aspects of our zero net energy design, we would be doing things that perhaps hadn't been done before anywhere in Australia. We got together with some really smart people and started looking at some of the unique attributes of this site and coming up with designs that had not been seen anywhere before. So for example, we're pretty much on a floodplain here. So our design incorporates screw piling for creating the stability for the structure itself. So then we started thinking, well, if we're going to screw pile the whole site, is there a way we could incorporate geothermal into that screw piling? So by incorporating absolute cutting edge research and development into this construction meant that we were adding some additional cost to the project. But that was an investment we were more than happy to make Given the real boost we thought that would make to members of our industry in equipping them to install and maintain these sorts of facilities in the longer term. From a net zero point of view, we had to alter the way we dealt with the building fabric. So essentially on the ground floor and generally we've got precast panels that are insulated. So that gives us quite a good uh, thermal rating from that point of view. We've, we've got a, a geothermal system that we've, we've installed in this building and what we've tried to do is, is not only build it but showcase it as well. So we've got some in-floor displays where, where these things can actually be seen and working and operating um, as you walk throughout the building. Tell me.